Breaking news, Nigerians. Truth is out. Nigeria in shock. See what really killed General Lagbaja and Miss Rumors. The presidency has announced the passing of General Lagbaja, the former chief of army staff who died at the age of 56. Bayo Ononoga, the special advisor to the president on information and strategy, issued a statement confirming the, the news on Wednesday. President Bola Tinubu, the commander-in-chief of the armed forces, expressed deep regret over the loss of uh, Lagbaja, General Lagbaja. It was great sorrow that I announced the passing of Lieutenant General Lagbaja, chief of the army staff. The statement reads, the general passed away on Tuesday night in Lagos after a prolonged illness. General Lagbaja was born on February 28, 1968, and began his distinguished military journey by joining the Nigerian Defense Academy in 1987. He was commissioned as a second lieutenant in the Nigerian Infantry Corps on September 19. 1992 as part of the 29th regular course throughout his service general lagbaja exemplified dedication outstanding leadership and outstanding leadership his military career in, included serving as a a platoon commander in the 93 battalion and the 97 special forces battalion he also played crucial roles in multiple national security operations, including Operation Zaki in Benue State, Operation Lafia Dolly in Borunu State, Operation Udoka in the Southeastern Region, and Operation Forest Sanity in Kaduna and Niger States. His strategic expertise and experts and commitment to national security left a significant mark on the Nigerian Armed Forces. General Lagbaja's pursuit of professional growth saw him graduate from the prestigious U.S. Army War College when he earned a master's degree in strategic studies, further highlighting his commitment to excellence in military leadership. The late general, he survived by his wife, Miriam, and two children, President Tinubu extended his heartfelt condolence to the family, the Nigerian military, and all who were imparted by General Lagbaja's life and service. The president also wished him eternal peace, recognizing the imminent contributions the, he made to the nation throughout his career. In a related development, President Tinubu has appointed General Olufemi Uluyade as the acting chief of army staff. Hours after the announcement of General Lagbaja's death, this decision marks a crucial step in maintaining uh, continuity within the leadership of the Nigerian army during this period of mourning. The nation member the, the, the nation remembers General Lagbaja not only for his military achievements, but also for his role as a dedicated leader committed to protecting and upholding the sovereignty and security of Nigeria. It's so sad that this man, you know, had to go like this. He was really doing a great job talking about taking it down on banditry in the north. He was really doing a great job, but you see, it is what it is. This is life for you, you understand? Nobody knows tomorrow. Nobody knows what happens the next minute, so this is life. He has, he has answered his call. Is everything now. He's now between him and God. So that is the reason why I always tell people, be very careful what you do, you know, how you relate with people what you do to people because you don't know what happens the next minute. You understand? And these are the things majority of people don't understand. 
life is too short for somebody to be doing evil because you don't know tomorrow. May so rest in peace. This is life. Well, we are all going to buy someday, but it's just that everybody no go go the same day. But the truth is, the truth is that one day, one day, it like that, it go happen. You get. So, guys, what's your take on this? Uh, kindly drop your comment below the comment section. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Please share this video. Let it go viral. Let Nigerians understand what is happening today in the Nigerian political landscape. Thank you, and bye.